This ad is brought to you by Read More Comics, where you can find comic books, graphic novels, and more. What is up guys, me again, the live action Disney remakes, I enjoy most of them, but that's not how most of you guys think, in fact, if I've done things the wrong way, I think I've been bashing them badly too hard, too much and too hard, but you guys don't appreciate what, I, what we actually got, now, I'm not saying these movies are perfect by any means, but they Give us what we wanted. The live action versions of these animated movies. Yes, some of them aren't as good as the classics. And some were misrepresentations, but other than that, I still enjoy most of them. Each of them brings something new and different. Others, it's just try a little hard. And possibly they make things worse. That's Maleficent, the remake, is a perfect example of that. And, well, well, I think I'll get a review, full review on that one another time. And for some reason, getting a sequel, for what those reasons. Irregardless, it's, and I know these movies aren't perfect. And I can imagine why you guys wouldn't like them. And they're poor misrepresentation of, of the original movies. Is, but others like myself see them more as they are perfect. They're perfect and nowhere near as flawed as everyone keeps saying that they are. Right, they're better. Some are better than the original. Oh. And there are some in between that are indifferent to them. They're like, ah, this movie was okay, but still wasn't as good as the original. The movie, or saying, that ah, I still like the movie okay. It might be better than the original. Me personally, I think that these movies are good. And the movie is themselves, in some cases, can be either really good or really bad. And, but it just crossed my mind, why do people keep hating the bashing these films, even before they've seen them? Is it because of the trailer? Well, that's partially a good reason. But... Sometimes for me, I like to see a movie before I, I quickly judge them. I know the trailers aren't helping them much, but let's be fair here. The trailer let's be the first time the trailers is what mislead audience to moviegoers. Remember the last Airbender trailer? Yeah, that's enough said. And well. Uh, the films are indeed an issue for everyone. For those who didn't like these films. Um, they don't like them because, well, they're some, some claims that don't need to exist and some say they're butchering the source material. Me, I don't see them butchering that much. I mean, that's a fair here. We saw seen worse remakes in, in, past, in the past, am I right? And, well, I'm... I'm the more open-minded type of a reviewer. Or, there are still bad things out there, trust me, but... Uh, let's be fair here, this far, these remakes are far from anything Disney has done on Wars over the years. It's, in fact, there's too many to count. Uh, I remember uh, watching the Alice in Wonderland remake. At first I thought it was okay, but then I realized it was trying way too hard to be like Nardia or Lord of the Rings. And man, it didn't add more problems than you could shake a tail at. I mean, give the other Disney remakes a credit, at least they were faithful to the source materials. But on the one land, was not. But I'll get a full review on that one another time, too. But 
yes, there are some cases where the remakes are done right, and some cases where these remakes are done wrong. And, well, uh, uh, there are people that are too open-minded or way too close-minded. I'm not trying to savagely attack anyone, but how about you guys try to be more open-minded and look to the future, instead of being stuck in the past. Or if you prefer to be stay in the past, that's okay too. No, I mean, I mean, we all have our nostalgias, as here and there, and well, it's still our nostalgia, nevertheless. If you always prefer the originals over the remake, that's good for you. If you prefer the remakes over the originals, that's also good for you. That's called being a unique human being. And hey, as long as you guys don't resort to cyberbullying, that's that's always a plus for everyone. And guys, let me tell you, there are a lot of cases where I saw reviewers and people on Twitter or Facebook savagely attacking these movies. And possibly savagely attacking the people who like these movies. I myself have not experienced one of those. But, like I said, if you like these movies or dislike them, that's all up to you. But, don't be such someone that I gonna be gonna try to force your opinion on other people. Be open minded. Have a unique, be a unique human being. And I myself am looking forward to the live action Lion King remake. A lot of people aren't, but me personally, I am. The Lion King's always been my childhood. It's my favorite Disney film of all time. And I'm always looking forward to the day they be adapted in live action form. Not and granted, uh, some other people didn't share my views, as declared on the internet, but I will hold it against them, because, well, they have different opinions. <laughs> and, well, I just hope you guys just learn to be open-minded, and hear what other people have to say about these films. And if you agree or disagree, that's fine. Hey. Hey. <laughs> and... Well, I, I get the feeling that people are going to have a mixed bag when they see the Lion King film. A part of me hoping they would like it, if or how it's trying to be its own thing while being faced with a source material like the 2016 Jungle Book remake was. And... It wouldn't be the first time Disney did live action. I mean, remember back in the 90s where they did... I already did a live action Jungle Book remake along with the 101 Dalmatian remakes. We both saw how those turned out, didn't we? But regardless, if you don't like these films or you hate them, um, they're trying to make a new generation like these films. And hey, if you didn't like these films, films, you can always go back to the original. Uh, and, well, they're possibly doing another thing right. If they're showing a new generation of these movies. If you if these children are watching the remakes, they would want to go and watch the originals. So, if you have a younger, have any children or younger siblings or such, after you see the remakes or before you see the remakes, go and watch the originals, and maybe they will decide whether they they like the original, prefer the originals over the remakes, or if they prefer are the remakes over the originals. It's their choices. So. Oh, let's all be unique human beings and just give these live-action films a chance before quickly judging them. And now, before we, we call it a day, here are my top five favorite live-action Disney films. Maybe after I see the Lion King remake, I'll change my list up a bit. Until then, that's all for today. See you all next time. Farewell, friends. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to check us out on Patreon, Facebook, DeviantArt, Twitter, FanFiction.net, Rattled, and Casting Call Club.